filter because there's so much chlorine in the water from them trying to clean the water. Mm -hmm. And I got this information from Dr. Gary Johnson, who's director for the health department. Mm -hmm. He says you can take a shower in lukewarm water, in lukewarm water, and the filter that is on that you put on your shower, it filters out the chlorine. But the problem with that then becomes the steam. If you're taking a hot shower, it becomes the vapors. from the vapors you inhale. Mm -hmm. You inhale the vapors. So that's why he says it has to be a lukewarm shower, not something hot, because you don't want to be able. To, and know. unfortunately, we don't even have filters on our our, our sink. I was going to get with you for Home Depot to find out what type of filter, because we have the sinks, um, the, oh, the, the, the um, no, the newer ones. Oh, gotcha. Uh, my husband changed the faucets that we have, the, the fashionable, modern, updated, yeah. modern ones. Mm -hmm. yeah. So the filters that they are passing out don't fit. So we need to we need to invest in some. Oh, and then they said there was something about a filtration system, um, water filtration system that they was going to try to get and those families are and stuff. Dollars. Right, so. Which, I mean, with I feel like with all of the federal aid and the aid that's coming in, that I wouldn't feel comfortable even when they changed the pipes because of the information that was not given. How do we begin to believe that you're working in our best interest now when before you said we were okay when we really weren't? Right, I don't know who to believe. So should we all still have filtration systems even right. though you said the water is okay? <coughs> and then last week there was a national break breaking alert, a boil water yeah. advisory. Main, advi a main, a main water main break. They had a boil water advisory out. It didn't, I mean, I didn't even bother with it because I didn't boil any water because I wasn't using that water. I don't use the water. I quit using it first last week. I said, okay, I did my laundry. I don't know if it's safe to use the laundry, do the laundry. Melissa May said it wasn't. She's the one that's involved in all this. She said it's not good. We can't, we shouldn't wash our clothes in it. But I had a room full of of clothes. I was getting ready to pack it up. I, I was bagging it all up to go to the laundry mat. And I said, you know, I was so frustrated. I said, it is what it is. If, if something will happen to us, let it be. I'm tired. But then, you know, when you when they say that you can wash your clothes, and then they say you can't wash your right. clothes, there's so much misinformation. You but then when you have a boil water advisory, okay, you can't boil lead out, so you know you can't boil right. it for that, but then you have to boil it for everything else, doesn't it? Right. So what, what's left? There's no water left then, right? So how, you know, how do you kill right. what you don't know? Then we were told with the plasticware that I've been washing my dishes. Because I was washing my dishes. Don't, you know, if you didn't wash your dishes in the plasticware in cold water, you need to um, dispose of them because the lead absorbed in the, um, oh. in the plastic. So, wow. so I, I pulled all my plasticware out and, and was trying to dispose of it. And 